welcome, 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 everyone. I hope everybody is doing well today. Well, you know, I decided today to make some dinner, okay? So I got up this morning, and uh, let me just show you guys. I, hold on. I cleaned and seasoned. This is a whole jerk chicken. The whole jerk chicken babies marinating right there. Then I said, eh, let me make my kids some snow crab legs, right? So I'm letting that thaw out. So what I did first is I peeled the garlic and, oh, we're going to have some watermelon. Ooh. So I have to wash that off, guys, you know. Yeah. And so I, I guess I'll make some brown rice and some, some type of vegetable. But anyway. Yeah, so many years ago I invested it in one of these. This is a ninja, a chopper, as you see. It's a ninja chopper. And, see, with the blade. Right? And so what I'll do is I put the garlic in there or whatever, onions, garlic, whatever you want to chop up. I just use this strictly for things like garlic and vegetables, you know, right? Put that on top of there. And then, this is so powerful, guys, that, trust me, you have to not, um, let me just put this over here because I have, so much stuff going on. I'm telling you guys, I'm in the middle of doing so much stuff. So yeah, I'll plug it in here. Again, this is the chopper. See, I put the garlic in there. Put that top there. Then you just press this down lightly because if, the more you press it down, the more it can be like a puree. See, so I do that. Then I want to chop, chop, chop. You see that, guys? If I hold it like that, it's a little chop. You see how fine that is? Let's see. I don't want like a puree. I mean, I could do it like that. Look at that, guys. Magic. Ooh-wee. So I have to go chop, 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 chop with a knife. So, and I always, when I'm finished, I always unplug it because somebody may make a mistake. And so, give me one second. You guys, you guys weren't supposed to see that. But anyway, <laughs> let me fix this. Okay. So what I'm going to do now is just, you know, just wipe this off. Wipe that off real quick. Let it air dry. Put it up here. Let it air dry a little bit. Now, the skin, I'm going to throw it in the garbage. Boom. I'll wash that out. And in the meantime, in between time, Anyway, wait a minute. Okay, so I'm just letting these store out some more. I put this napkin on these because I seen it was dripping a little bit. And um, so this is all the ingredients that I'm going to use for the garlic, uh, for the garlic sauce. Lemon, a real lemon. See this? Creole seasoning. My old bae. My son asked him to pick me up one of these because he knows that I'm not with the sort thing. Look what he buys me. 30% less sodium than the original. Huh, he's so nice. And, um, and some butter. Well, actually, I have this butter. Hold on a moment, guys. I don't know which one I'm going to use. I'll think about it. See? I might use that one. Yeah, so. Um, oh, 
Thanks to my sister, Cool Vibes. She bought me a whole case of these. <laughs> I love them. So see Cool Vibes? See, I have it all lined up. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So I'm waiting for these to thaw out. And, you know, the crabs don't take long. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my chicken in the oven. Let me just, um, what I'm going to do now is just preheat the oven. Let it on bake. Press start. And let it preheat. You know? So this is chopped up already. I didn't have to chop, chop, chop with a knife. I can't be doing it. I can't be so bothered, y'all. You know? I did the easy way out. Normally I would chop it, but... Uh, so, yeah. So while the oven is preheating... Um, let's see. I have to pack these things up right here. So that's why I left it here. Ooh. I love these sliced almonds. I eat them just like that. Mm -hmm. Sure do. Yeah, guys, so what are you all doing today? Tell me what you're doing today. Hmm. You know what I might make? So let me see. Should, what should I do with these potatoes? Because I don't want them to go bad. Because my kids, they don't, they don't be doing this stuff. They don't be doing this stuff, y'all. They really don't. They don't. They won't cut no potatoes up. They won't do none of that. So, yeah, just straightening this stuff up a little bit. Oh, and of course, I have to put some, I bought some, some type of beer that goes with the crabs. You know, that goes with the crabs. Oh, yeah, I got to get my black pepper. What else? Uh, black pepper, black pepper, where you at? Where you at, black pepper, where you at? Where you at, black pepper, where you at? Oh, so I use some black pepper. See, my ingredients. This, well, the black pepper don't go in the garlic sauce, but this, 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 and this go with the, and this. Can't show you the beer, but that goes there. So once I start cooking it, guys, you will see how I prepare this. Hmm. Yeah, that looks good. These are the basic ingredients for your garlic sauce. Uh, butter garlic sauce or garlic butter sauce and your for your seasoning for your crab everybody does it different you know this is the garlic right here it's already chopped up chop 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 mm -hmm. and I'm going to use I'm going to use this avocado oil to make my butter garlic sauce. See, avocado oil. Yes, style Yes, guys, so these crab legs are in here. Let me turn the fire down a little something. And let these steam right on in here. Let me get the top. Ooh, baby, 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 baby. Mm -mm. For about 10, 12, 15 minutes. Yes. Let them steam up a little bit. I done put my Old Bay seasoning, the Creole seasoning. You know, now I'm about to, I'm getting ready to make the, the garlic butter sauce. So I put some avocado oil, like I said before, in the frying pan, All right? It's heating up a little bit. So my stand that I have to hold my phone 
it's packed up, so I'm not getting that out. So I'm holding you holding the phone with my hand. So of course I can't do 50 million things at one time, right? So yeah, so I'm just letting this yeah. And so you can smell the garlic. Ooh. Ooh. Mm, 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 mm. So once I do that, then I'm going to add just a pinch of seasoning, right, for that creole. Oh my gosh, I dropped it. See what happens. And then I'm going to add a pinch of this. That means I have to mop these floors. Oh my gosh, right? Mmm. Yummy, yummy. Then I'm going to add. Da -da -da. It's going to be alive. Oh. Mm -hmm. Maybe see what happens when you. Don't have your stand. Look at that. Look what I did, guys. Horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Now I gotta wipe all this up. You guys, at least you follow me. Yeah, I still have my birthday stuff up here. <laughs> yes, darling. It's only been a week. Today made a week. I have to wipe this up. Oh, gosh. Now I have to, because I was soaking my, my, um, mop heads. So I'm going to have to go outside and wash them off real good because I soaked them in, in bleach. And I don't use bleach on my floors. So I have to go outside and wash them out. Wash all that bleach off real good. Yeah. Okay, so, wash my hands real quick. Oh, my hand. <laughs> oh, and I also added, oh my God, I forgot to put a lemon. Wait a minute, y'all. Chicken in the oven. Oh, that smells so good. Then, and then, once these get done, guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to drizzle a little bit of that butter sauce on here. And then save the rest of the butter so sauce to put it. Oh, good baby, look at this. It's a hot mess here. This is a hot mess, guys. So, once I clean all this up, cut my watermelon. <laughs> I'll be good to go. Yes. And you will see the end results. Yes, I'm going to cut this watermelon. Let's see how juicy and sweet it will be. Okay, guys, so that's the finishing touch. That touch, sorry, that is the butter, garlic butter sauce. The chicken. Listen, guys, I was hungry. I ate a piece. But you get it. Mm -mm -mm. That chicken. Baby, let me tell you something. I put a little, I jerked it a little bit. And these are the seat no crab legs. Ooh, child. Boom. And then they can just make a salad or steam some, 
saute some spinach or or carrots and cabbage and whatever. I'm done for the day. Okay. So guys, thank you so much for following me. I have oh I gotta cut my watermelon up. And I gotta just wash these few little dishes. Everything else is clean, washed, done. Yeah. So I just gotta straighten up over there. And thanks for watching. I appreciate you. I'm going to cut this watermelon. It's gonna we're gonna see how sweet this watermelon really is. Mm-hmm. See, you think this is a good enough knife? I think so. Yes. What do you guys think? Think it's sweet? Uh, well, we'll try it. Guys, now I'm going to be the tester. Let's see. Let me turn this around. Okay, let's see. Let me get a plate. Hold on. Guys, let me get a plate. Let's get a plate. Let's get a plate. Ding. You have to use one hand to do everything because my gadget that I have to hold my camera is packed away. So, oh, sorry about the hand. Oops. Oh, girl, your hair look a hot mess, but you know what? It's one of them days. Okay. So, I have to use a fork. Excuse the finger. Let me hold it this way. Mm -mm -mm. Guys, this is so good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. What's up? Help yourself. That's good. That's good stuff. The taste, I'll give it a 10. Natural, I'll give it a zero, because there's no seeds in here. It is seeds in here, very little seeds. Mm -hmm. But remember when you were younger, and they had the black seeds in watermelon? 